to bring out our top 10 and welcome to the stage our contestants. Bring out contestant number 10, Basha. Contestant number 11, Jasmine Bonet. Number 13, Yoshiko Oshirio. Number 19, Paris, France. Number 20, Regine Phillips. Number 21, Michonne Black. And number 22, Angela Carrera. Number 31, Natasha Richards. Number 32, Michelle Mitchell. Number 35, Brandy Lee. Number 36, Sasha Valentino. And number 37, Lady, Lady Katiria. And now, Jim Flint. <laughs> And here comes the owner of the pageant, Jim Flint, with a large dagger for my back. <laughs> all right, ladies and gentlemen, this is what you waited for. Before we get our top five, let's give all of these lovely contestants a nice round of applause. Yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen and contestants, if I call your number, we'd ask you to just step Two spaces forward, we'll excuse the rest. Hey, hey, hey. I'm not gonna call any numbers till you all get quiet. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, let's bring out contestant number 11. Let's bring out contestant number 19, Paris, France. Let's bring out contestant number 37, Lady Kateria. Let's bring out contestant number 31, Natasha. And last but not least, ladies and gentlemen, let's bring out contestant number 36, Sasha Valentina. All right. All right, ladies, as I call your name, we'd like to ask you to leave, and one gets to stay here, okay? All right, ladies and gentlemen, we will let, leave at the stage Lady Kateria, number 37. Let's give her a nice round of applause. Number 36, Sasha Valentino. Number 31, Natasha Richards. Number 19, Paris, France. And number 11 stays with me, Jasmine Bonet. How are we doing, Jasmine? Just fine. Not nervous, are you? Jasmine, please tell me, the judges, and our guests, the three proudest achievements in your life. Please tell me, the judges, and our guests, the three proudest achievements in your life. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Once again, I'm Jasmine Bonet, your contestant number 11, finalist number one. The things, the three most things that I'm most proud of tonight. First, I would have to say that I know Jesus Christ is my Lord and personal Savior. <laughs> I like to know, I like to say that I know where I'm going in life, I know where I've been, so that tells me I know where I'm going. And last but certainly not least, the ability and the knowledge to know that you can do whatever you want to do, whenever you want to do it, and how you want to do it. Thank you.
Thank you, contestant number... I love it, Jasmine Bonet. Contestant number 19, Paris, France, ladies and gentlemen. How are we doing, Paris? I'm fine. You're fine? I wish I was. I'm going to read this to you twice, then you get answered, OK? OK. Paris, please tell me, the judges, and our guests, the three proudest achievements in your life. Please tell me, the judges, and our guests, the three proudest achievements in your life. Thank you. Once again, I'm contestant number 19, Paris, France. To answer the question, the three proudest achievements in my life. Number one is my degree in fashion design from the Fashion Institute of Design and Merchandising in California. Number two is the fact that I have taken the courage to not only take hormones or do, just do pageants, but to give myself a better way of life by changing my lifestyle to comfort me, not for nobody else. And the third proudest achievement that I am, a pro that I am proud of, sorry, is that I have accepted myself and I have told all of my family, my family accepts me for not only who I am, but what I have become. Thank you very much. Paris, France, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Woo. And now contestant, ladies and gentlemen, we're waiting for contestant number 31, Natasha. Hi, doing, Natasha. Very good, thank you. You look good, too. You seem more relaxed than I am. Not really. <laughs> Natasha, I'll read this twice to you, and then it's up to you to answer it, OK? Please tell me, the judges, and our guests, the three proudest achievements in your life. Please tell me, the judges, and our guests, the three proudest achievements in your life. Thank you, Jim. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Natasha Richards. I'm contestant number 31. Last year, they asked me a very similar question. And I have to say that my home is one of the proudest achievements that I've ever, ever done, because I purchased it myself. And I still have my little garden. And um, the second thing I would, I would think would be um, living as a woman, because I think that was one of the most bravest things I've ever done. And I'm very, very proud of that. And I'm very, very happy, actually. And um, the third thing I would say is, um, well, doing the art of female impersonation because it is in my blood. I love it. And, and it's just where I need to be. And judges, this is my second year applying for the position as Ms. Continental. <laughs> and um, I just want to say, please hire me. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs> All right, that was contestant 31, and now we're gonna move on with contestant number 36, Sasha Valentino. How are we doing, Sasha? I'm doing fantastic. Great. All right, Miss Thing, you heard that, didn't you? Okay. Sasha, please tell me, the judges and our guests, the three proudest achievements in your life. Please tell me, the judges, and our guests, the three proudest achievements 
in your life. Good evening once again, ladies, gentlemen, and judges. I am contestant number 36, and my name is Sasha Valentino. First of all, the first year that I ran for Miss Continental was about three years ago. That has to be one of the proudest moments of my life. The first time I entered, I was third runner up, and I was so happy. Thank you. <laughs> My second achievement was when I became a preoperative sexual was to get my mother and my family to accept me, which I did, and now I, they show me love like they have never shown me before, and that's the, the first achievement that I am so proud of as of to date. Thank you so much. <laughs> and last but not least, my third achievement is tonight. Tonight, ladies, gentlemen, and judges, I have worked hard all year. I have traveled. I have went through obstacles. And now, ladies, gentlemen, and judges, I show you Sasha Valentino as you have never seen her before. Thank you so much. Contestant number 36, ladies and gentlemen, Sasha Valentino. That is my proudest achievement. Thank you. Okay, here they are. Our final contestant, ladies and gentlemen, contestant number 37, Lady Kateria. Hi, Joe Kateria. I'm doing fine, thank you. Doing fine. I'm going to read the question for you, and it's up to you to answer it, okay? I'll read it twice to you. Please tell me, the judges, and our guest, the three proudest achievements in your life. Please tell me, the judges, and our guest, the three proudest achievements in your life. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome. And my name is Lady Kateri. I'm sorry, I'm a little nervous. And I am your contestant number 37. My three greatest achievements in my life. One of those, ladies and gentlemen, is being the person who I am today. The entertainer, the happy person, the beautiful, the beautiful woman. That is the first one. And in life, ladies and gentlemen, you run into a lot, a lot of trouble. And I did run into a lot of trouble. And six, maybe seven years ago, I was a drug addict. And one of my achievements, greatest achievements, is staying off drugs. And my third achievement, my third achievement has taken me six years. For six years, I've been preparing for this night. For six years, I've been coming here. I entered Miss Continental Plus. Thank you, Lord, for giving me that. And ladies and gentlemen, Continental Plus gave me a taste of what it would be like if I were to be crowned tonight. This is my next achievement in life. I don't have a third one. Make it a third one. Have a good night and thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, Lady Kateria.